In the previous video, we generally, we basically created a new form and we dropped in our data grid view from the keycard set. Now we can't see this data until we set up a query and we do a few more steps so that when we click on a button to say like view card information about the user, it will actually populate pulling that query and what we call parameters. So to do that, first what we need to do is create the query. So come over to here to your solutions explorer and then double click on the sample data set.xsd. And notice we have our residence grid, we have our table, we have all of this information. What we're going to want to do, and it looks like if you're used to databases, this should look somewhat similar. We want to create a relationship between the key card and the resident from the resident ID to the resident ID here. So click on toolbox, expand your toolbox, and then double click on relation. The name is going to be keycard resident. So we have a parent of table keycard and a child table of resident. So let's go ahead and let's change the columns from card number to resident ID and keep the foreign key as resident ID. Or vice versa, if you prefer, you can actually set this as resident and then keycard and do resident ID and the foreign key, which would make more sense, as resident ID. And then we're going to set this as a relation only and click OK. Continue in the next video for the next step.